All right, so today we're gonna be changing the, what is this called? Zero gravity visor from the stock one. This one doesn't provide any like wind support when you're on the highway. If you're on the highway, it just blows you literally everywhere. Um, so this is supposed to prevent that it's about, looks like three inches. Oh, that's a lot of damage! Higher up and it's tinted. And then after throw on these like Amazon frame sliders. So let's get started. So I'm guessing it's just one, two, three, four bolts on it to slip this off. We might have to take off the uh, mirrors, but hopefully not. And then the frame sliders. just screw into here. I think you just pop this off. Okay, so literally just unscrew each one. And each one has this and a little plastic washer so you don't scratch the paint. Now let's see if this thing just pops out. Yep. And if you have this off, you might as well clean this with something, which I'm about to do right now. Just some protectant. Okay, now hopefully it just slides in. Yep. Damn. That looks way better. So actually you're gonna have to take off these stock grommets and put them inside the zero gravity visor. So it should just pop right out. Two thousand years later. Yeah, they pull out. Or it's easier to pull out than push out. One, two. One, two.
And these are different sizes. Focuses, the long one goes on the bottom, the small one goes on top. And that's it for the visor. So, change of plan since the uh, frame sliders don't fit, I'm gonna install the Puick uh, fork sliders, which is just quick, it's just one end and the other end on the front fork, and I'll show you guys that now. So, you just have to find the one that fits inside each space. So this one right here fits that. You add a little washer on the end right here, and you just stick it through. That's what she said! <laughs> and it's gonna end up looking like that. Then you go over on the other side, get the other one. A washer and a nut. And you see it sticking out on the other end. So it's just a 10 millimeter al or an Allen uh, socket. I would put some thread locker on this. It's way too much. Wood. So then just tighten. Then it comes with a cap, goes in each end, and that's it. A little more protection, because protection is always good. Yeah, baby! <laughs> yeah.